How can you go and test a mini app on mobile? How can you do domain associations, manifests, farcaster.json, uh, showing up the proper account in base app? How can you do all of that? Like you will need a phone and it has to be in the farcaster app or whoever has your custody address. If you don't know what that means, probably if you have the farcaster app, that just means open the farcaster app. So right, just whoever owns the marketing account, the brand account or the account that should be shown on top of a mini app, that's the one. What do I mean by shown? Well, if you open the Morpho app, at the top it says Samuel L. Uber. This, I did it, so that's why it sh shows that up there. So if we actually go and want to do that ourselves, you have to first open up your little sidebar. So click on your profile or swipe left, and then we can go settings. And on settings, we have to go into advanced, unless you already see developer settings down here, we have to go into advanced scroll all the way down and at the bottom of advanced we can click developer mode so on developer mode now we actually see the preview tool the domain associations and we can check that the preview tool is the top one here we can go and we can test many apps so for spur for example we can see uh, is the image loading start spur relating is that the message we want to have there and somebody clicks and then you can see Oh, is my mini app loading up? Is it working? And as you can see, this one is working beautifully. And at the top, it says Spore by Samuel. If we now want to change this to the Spore team, to Spore, then the one controlling that account, usually it's like the founder, the marketing person, or you as a developer, if this is you going through it and you want to have this for your own mini app, then goes into domains, and then you type in your URL. So this is without HTTPS, without anything else, just dtech.vision for me. And then if you want to check your domain status, you can check it. Or if you are if you haven't done this before, generate domain manifest. At top, it says manifest copied. So if we paste something below here, you'll quickly see, oh, this is actually all of some uh, gibberish. The one thing that's really interesting for you here is this, because this is the account association. You will send this to your developer or use the specific header values in environment variables or just literally paste this and make this your uh, manifest.json, like your dot well known slash farcaster.json. And this is all you need. So if a developer asks you, hey, can you please do the account association? You just need to send them whatever is in here right now. So you can send them him the full thing or they uh, or her and they could take care of it. So this is how you actually get a domain association. Let's do it again. It says manifest copied. Now you can paste this, send this to the developer or your team. You can also check domain status to see, oh, has it already been done? And if so, for who? So here, detect on vision, it says 16085. So that's me. How can I, how can you know that? You go to my profile, you click on the three dots, you go on about, and it says FID. So on any profile, you can quickly check what the FID is and verify it there. So that's how you actually can work with mini apps, enable developer mode, go through, test mini apps on mobile, do account association. And if you ever need any other mini app help, DTAG is at your service. We're just one message away.